I wrote this poem to women in Kosovo because I had read an article by the journalist Orla Guerin and she had been in Kosovo and she had met two sisters and they were sitting in a cafe and soldiers came in and basically um, just shot everywhere and uh, they were um, dragged with all the other dead people onto a truck and then they both realized that they were actually alive and what should they do and so one sister whispered to the other will we jump so I wrote this poem to women in Kosovo um, about them and for um, Orla Guerin, who I think is such a brave woman. Two women in Kosovo. I'm going to jump, her sister whispers, holding out her hand. And so they jump together, so naturally they might be young girls again, leaping at waves on their holidays, jumping across rivers on their way to school, pulling each other over the road to grown-up things. From the side of the truck out onto the rolling dust and scrub, they jump, tea and bread they've just eaten with the others, a thump in their stomachs when they fall. Holding hands tight, they jump, Two women in Kosovo, leaving behind their children, their mother, their husbands, gunned down by soldiers in a roadside cafe minutes before, and now a mountain of grief being driven to a mass grave somewhere these sisters will never find. One looks back for a second, feels her whole life piled ugly there, feels it was beautiful once, the pull of her man reaching for her in the middle of the night, the bitter pain she knew when her four-year-old left her for his first day at school, her mother calling her back home on a cold winter's night. Luck chooses where we are born, passes us through life unscathed by violence. Luck is this brave woman now defying the brutal guards, rising alive from her pretend death and the horror of corpses, the people she's loved, a frightened survivor pulling her frightened sister forward, a sister whispering, jump.